The 1996 Honda Kart IndyCar was a major milestone in Honda's open-wheel racing journey. Powered by the Honda HRH V8 engine, this 2.65-liter turbocharged beast delivered around 850 horsepower, making it one of the most competitive engines on the grid. Built to comply with kart regulations, the car had to weigh a minimum of 1,550 pounds with driver, use methanol fuel, and conform to strict aerodynamic and safety standards. That year marked Honda's first kart manufacturer's championship, with teams like the Target Chip Ganassi Racing and drivers such as Jimmy Basser, the eventual series champion, showcasing its dominance. These cars were so blazingly fast, topping 230 miles an hour on superways and physically brutal, drivers experiencing up to 5 Gs in the corners, demanding extreme neck and core strength. Endurance was also essential with the core strength as some races lasted up to 500 miles with no power steering. Now, while fans adored the screaming V8s and high-speed duels, one weird fact sticks out. The engine block design was so precise, some parts had to be cooled in dry ice before fitting just to make them contract enough to slide into place. Performance, after all, leaves no room for error.